Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Well, you may remember that I posted a video over a month ago now about a Scottish driver that I booked for a platform that threatened me because I'm demanding more money. Well, he demanded more money, and then when I refused to give him more money, then he threatened me. And this was after the job was completed. <coughs> Sorry about that. Right. So there is an update and the platform in question who, yes, I may have said some negative things about in the past. I've actually done their job this time and have done the right thing from what I, from my opinion. So, uh, the platform have removed the driver in question and it actually turns out this was not the first incident with this driver which you can see coming from a mile off with his attitude and his demeanor uh, this was not the first incident by far uh, but this was the first incident where the shipper myself had evidence against the driver in like the voicemail etc so this driver has played a dirty tactic in the past and he's pulled a, uh, let's say, a dirty card against other shippers and to the platform itself. And they've always resolved that, it would seem, by removing the feedback for both parties. So he never had any negative feedback because it was removed because of this dirty card he was pulling. And he tried pulling the same dirty card on me only a few days ago um, when the platform itself um, sent me some of the replies that he was sending to them and he was also calling them. Um, and the, yeah, In the end, they decided that due to the voicemail, the threatening behaviour, it went against their gross misconduct and it was time that that gentleman was no longer allowed on the platform. And there was a lot of naysayers in the video that I did a while back saying this isn't the entire story, there's something else going on, blah, blah, blah. Basically not believing me. But at the end of the day, the last month has been quite stressful due to I don't know if some random's going to turn up at my house and threaten my family whilst I'm not in for money because he didn't seem very stable to me. And that is the update. So he has been removed. So none of you guys that work on that platform will have to uh, well, put up with his behaviour because it was absolutely atrocious. <coughs> In other news, I got a phone call yesterday about uh, from another shipper driver, small company like myself, who was having an, an issue with the same platform uh, regarding feedback and... So what had happened basically was he quoted on a job for a much bigger shipper and the shipper in question had left him negative feedback due to the conversation they'd had. So what had happened was he uh, put a quote in, they phoned him to book him and he asked if there was going to be handball and they said yeah there'll be handball at both sides. So he said oh right okay it wasn't in the description so my quote's going to have to change. Uh, where they said, no, we're not giving you any more money. So he said, okay, I won't be able to do the job. Which, to me, that's perfectly fine. You can do that. If the description is not right on the job, you phone them and ask them questions, and it cha <coughs> <coughs> and the job changes, then by all means, you don't need to do that job. But he had done a job for them only three weeks earlier. And they went to that job, and decided to leave negative feedback on it regarding the conversation they'd had. Um, which to me is absolutely bang out of order. If in that job three weeks ago he did a good job. You can't leave him feedback for not doing a job. Um, originally the platform said they didn't want to get involved. And then after actually looking at the feedback and determining it was from a past job. They said that the bigger shipper can't do that because it's not on the job that... Uh, they were talking about etc so the feedback eventually 
a day or two later it got removed um, but in this time that driver lost work because he phoned a couple of people that had used it before and they said yeah your quote's fine but that negative feedback we don't like fe negative feedback so we're not going to use you this time luckily now it's removed but it cost him money in the two days that it was up all just to be spiteful really from the bigger shipper for him not doing that job which is ridiculous oh, and that <coughs> is all because I've got a frog in my throat and I can't get rid of it it's doing me anyway. thank you for watching <laughs> please do like and subscribe and I'll catch you on the next one bye bye